what is up everybody thank you so much for opening this video welcome to my channel if you're new please hit the subscribe button and let's be a family so um yeah let's get into it so i like starting on the daily or the weekly but in this case i can see a clear picture here on the daily so this is aud usd daily time frame i see that this is an obvious uptrend right and the way that this is obvious you can clearly see that the market is moving in a corrective manner and impulsive manner we can clearly see here that the market has has clearly been moving on an uptrend and it has been respecting corrective structures as well as impulsive moves okay so then um let's first draw let's first find our trend you can see here we have an uptrend beautiful so this is a valid uptrend because we have confirmed three rejections on this support trend line all right so making it a valid uptrend and um the way this is so simple you guys you can see that the market wants nothing else but to move to the upside but we can only confirm that with more confirmations than just using the trend line to confirm this move right and um, another thing that we realize here on the daily time frame is that the market clearly respects corrective structures it respects when the market creates patterns and what do we have here we have a corrective structure and a corrective pattern right here and what we will be looking for is a break out of that pattern if the market doesn't respect this trend line we would expect something like this we have a level right here we would expect obviously the market to break underneath this level and not only retest this level but it's also testing our level of confluence which is the level and the trend line and then push to the downside all right but remember we never want to go against the trend and it's clear that the market is moving to the upside on an uptrend now we want to see how can we enter when can we enter or where can we enter that is where you move to your lower time frame so i'll check out the four hour first and see if is there any possible um entries right here and as you can see on the lower time frames the market has already rejected that is where you can see that oh the market is clearly moving to the upside because we have rejections right here look at this level all right this is a level where market is failing to break out of and if you take a look here it has reacted as a resistance before and then finally now it wants to react as a support level so it's respecting this level of support that was once resistance and also at the same time respecting this pattern right here as you can see these touches it's a it's a major level of high confluence all right look at this it's respecting so much that is why it pushed to the upside drastically and so now we want to enter is it the right time to enter no because you don't know especially with with a small account we might have a drawdown right here where market is kind of rejecting for a little bit you know until finally it decides to push up we don't know what the market might do so that is why we continue to move down to the one hour time frame as you guys can see we are moving from the top to the down that is why it's called a top down analysis so now we have a clear, a clear vision from the daily we saw that the market is moving on an uptrend we saw that the market was currently within a corrective structure and now we see that on, on the four hour time frame the market has rejected our our trend line has rejected moving further downwards and so we want to enter the market we have a clear vision of what is going on so when can we enter and what can we do to enter now we see that the market has broke a clear trend to the downside this minor descending channel was broken and then finally market shot up all right so what you can do is you can place your levels right here obvious levels here in, in the market where the market was clearly rejecting so we'll, we'll adjust to obtain multiple touches here as you can see this was a resistance resistance and then finally a breakout we'll also mark a few other levels right here that we see that market might respect there you go so now um market can probably move up until here 
to touch this level of resistance and respect that level and then maybe come back here to test this level that was broken because this level was never tested so if it comes back down here this is where we can probably find an entry all right and so this is also the one hour time frame when you see here we also have a valid um, trend line because as you can see we have one two touches we might be looking forward to a third touch right here so that is why the market might come down to this level to test the trend line and also maybe test this zone level all right and then that is where you will you will be waiting for rejections and once you finally find your rejections you can enter for your buy you can buy and well these levels that i set up here you can use them as your take profit you can use them to scale in you can use them for for exits and all of that your first take profit will be here and if you want to hold until market finally breaks out of this corrective structure you can move your stop loss from here because probably you would have placed it around here you can move your stop loss to your entry point right just in case the market decides to come back down again and you can break even after moving your stop loss to here this level where you entered to your entry level you can just leave the trades to run and then whenever you come back to your charts to check if whether the market has broken out of this level you can move your stop loss to 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 profits and, and lock profits and protect your profits and just let the trade be so that is what you can do if you want more tutorials on this, make sure to DM me, WhatsApp me, Telegram me. I have given you every possible way to get in touch with me down there on the description below. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like the video. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. All right. I need you to subscribe and like the video. All right. So, guys, thank you very much for opening this video. I hope this top down analysis was helpful to you and um, everyone who's watching. Thank you. Love and peace.